Hey my legion, how y'all doing today? I got a a review from JJ's uh, Retro Eatery in Union City and this is their uh, Hound Dog Hot Dog but inspired by Elvis Hound Dog Hot Dog and it's made from uh, Smith's Hot Dog which is really popular in Erie it says 1927 your generations of legendary quality and I was originally going to get the uh, foot long hot dog for $3.96 at uh, JJ's Retro Eatery and they didn't have any foot long hot dog bun so they offered a uh, just give me the regular one at two sixty five. They they I asked they said you could get two regular ones. I said, Could I get that for the price of foot long? And they said, Well, we don't know if you can or not. So I said, Well, I'll just get reg one regular hot dog. And this is a Smith hot dog with chili uh, spicy chili sauce, jalapeno peppers, banana peppers, and uh, habanero uh, ketchup. I almost said mustard. Let's give this a shot. Do this for tribute to Elvis and also uh my friend uh, Steph from Leather and Jade, and also they said rock and roll. We are both for channels. So let's try it out. The Hound Dog from JJ's Retro Eatery. Now it's good and spicy. Now I feel a heat kicking in now. And see some of habanero ketchup. Mm, awesome. And the chili tastes really good. Getting the heat from the peppers. Let's try another bite with uh, two peppers. There you go. And a pretty solid hot dog. Two sixty-five. <clears throat> might be a low on a pricey side, but I paid two twenty-nine for the Burger King chili uh, cheese dog. I like this real one. It's got the delicious taste of the traditional Smith hot dogs made locally. And this is good. I mean, I don't know when the next time I'll ever go to this place is. Cause I mean, it was kind of a comedy of errors with the service uh, as far as the two dinners are concerned. But this is really good. I give this a. Uh, Oh, a 9 out of 10 for uh, JJ's Retro Eatery Elvis Hound Dog. So until next time, everybody, please take care of my legion. Alright. Take care, buddy. And I will say, I mean, I halfway done it. It had a decent amount of heat. It does have spice to it. Mainly from the peppers and the habanero ketchup. Delicious. Well, it's a 9 out of 10. It's not bad at all for JJ's Eatery's uh, Elvis Hot Dog. Well, like I said, take care of my legion.